In this video, I'd like to show you two techniques which target soleus, the underlying of your two calf muscles, the lower one. One is a stretching technique and one is a roll stretch technique. Roll stretch is designed to help you soften and relax fascia. It's very effective. We use various tools. In this case, we're going to be using a hard stick, a dowel, and we do the roll stretch techniques Firstly, when the muscles and other tissues involved are in a completely relaxed state, but we also use the roll stretch techniques when the same targeted tissues are experiencing some stretch. And that's what was going to happen today in this particular exercise. So let's get into it. First, the stretching exercise, then we'll add the roll stretch technique. You need a bench of some sort. I've got my trusty piano stool, and this is the position. With all calf exercises, you want to make sure the foot is pointing directly forwards and you're preserving your ankle alignment. You don't want it to roll in. And then you sink down as much as you can. You're trying to get your buttock as close to the heel as you can. And if we're going to make it a stronger stretch, this other leg, I'm going to reach it out behind me and I'll use it as a driving force. Because I've got the stool here, I can hold onto the front and I can use my arms to both pull my bum right down towards the heel and also pull my weight forward and drive through the back foot, the foot that's on the floor there. So I can really get some good force happening here to get a strong stretch, which is often difficult when you're doing the floor version if you can't get your body's weight forward enough whilst keeping your glute as close to the heel as possible. So you've got lots of freedom of movement here. You can also do some side to side rocking movements because you've got your body weight coming through very nicely here. You do a standard contract relax, which is to try and push the ball of the foot down through the stool. Five, four, three, two, one, stop, and then re-stretch. See if you can go a little bit further. So there's the stretching exercise. It's way more powerful done up on a stool like this. Now for the roll stretch technique. So here I come out so that I can put the stick here. And because we're trying to target the lower calf muscle, I'm not going to put it right up behind the back of the knee. And then I come back into that same stretch position. And I'll show you a variety of things you can do here. I can come back and get myself deep into the stretch again. And then I can use my arms to press the stick into soleus and all the lower calf muscle there. I can do side to side movements. I can do twisting movements, and this will help you get into different tissues in the calf muscle there. Very, very powerful, quite painful too. And then I can reposition the stick. I'm rolling it down a little bit lower. Of course, there's also the involvement now of the Achilles tendon that I can be pressing into and lots of people are quite sensitive through there. So it's very effective if you get any irritation through the Achilles tendon. And the other part that's involved here is actually your hamstring. So if you hold onto the stick like this, you can be pulling the stick onto the hamstring. And as I drive through the foot that's down on the floor there, it also has the stick still pushing into the soleus and all the tissues through the lower calf there. Move around, breathing of course, and spend a little bit of time here. If you're like me and you tend to have quite rigid calf muscles that will not relax willingly, um, spend a little bit of time. It doesn't need to be super intense, but you can really pull it on and make it quite intense in this particular version. So give that one a go.